The 1 0 pitch. Brady drives the ball to center field and deep. At the wall. It's gone! Matt Brady walked off home run! Ever since I was a little kid, I wanted to be a big leaguer. Matt Beatty is perhaps the most surprising impact player on this 2019 Dodgers roster. The 26 year old rookie is one of a handful of Dodgers midseason call ups making major contributions on the big league stage, a goal the Georgia native has had since early youth. My parents put a bat and ball in my hand early, uh, three, four years old, I guess. And I don't know, I just really enjoyed going out and just swinging the bat, you know, throwing the ball, playing catch with my dad in the yard, him hitting me ground balls and stuff like that. So the love of the game's always kind of been there and just enjoy. I remember going to Turner Field when I was a little kid and, you know, watching those guys on the field and it just, I always wanted to be there, so. It's pretty special. Unlike some of his fellow Dodgers rookies, Beatty's path was more traditional. A 12th round pick in the 2015 draft out of Belmont University, Beatty developed a grinder mentality as he persevered through the Dodgers farm system before making his major league debut on April 30th of this year. Kind of have a chip on your shoulder and just prove that you belong at every level that you're at. And that's kind of, that's kind of, that was kind of my mindset going into, you know, every day in the minor leagues. It's like, hey, I belong here. Um, and, you know, that mindset helped motivate me to keep going every single day. That hunger for a guy like Matt Beatty and getting here and not wanting to go back to the minors and doing whatever it takes to help us win baseball games. And he uh, epitomizes, you know, what we're all about. That grinder, tough guy who is intelligent. You know, I talk a lot about having the best baseball players, but also I want the smartest baseball players. And he does a lot of things, whether it's on the bench, defensively in the batter's box to help us win baseball games. Way back there, and gone! Matt Beatty delivers again! Was there any doubt? His teammates now call him the hitman because of his clutch performances at the plate, something he attributes to a calm demeanor in the box. I think just not making it more than what it is. I mean, obviously it's a big moment, it's a big at bat or whatever, but you just gotta know how he's gonna attack you and not chase his pitch and get something that's out over the middle part of the plate because if, obviously if it's a big part of the game, there's gonna be runners on, so he's not gonna wanna walk you also. So. He, more than likely you're gonna get something pretty good to, or like over the plate to hit. So that's kind of my mindset. It's just, you know, not get too wound up in the moment and just kind of breathe and, and just let it settle in and, and go up there and trust yourself. The Dodgers formulated this season's roster with a mix of youthful talent and veteran experience. A combination Beatty says makes for a family-like feel in the clubhouse. You got Kershaw, JT, AJ, um, David Freeze, Rich, Rich Hill. I mean, you can keep going on down the list. Those guys are awesome. Nick, feel welcome. Um, you don't ever feel out of place. We enjoy coming to the clubhouse every day. We feel confident that you know we're going to go out there and have a good game. Um, and then also just talking with the guys. You don't even have to talk about baseball. Just talk about life. Um, all those guys, they're awesome. And you know, whenever they're talking, I just try to be a sponge and kind of soak it all up. A notable rookie season, notwithstanding, the pure depth of this Dodgers team has Beatty on the fringe of a playoff roster spot, and he's by no means the only one. Obviously, everybody wants to, you know, be on the roster and stuff like that. But for me personally, you can't really think about that. You just got to go out there and control what you can control and play your your game on the field. And you know, if you get the opportunity, then you know it's going to be awesome but at the same time like if you think about it too much you're going to put pressure on yourself and that can be a domino effect in the wrong way so just for me it's just not think about that right now just take every day as it is and and, and go out there and play my game